you want to Please don't be polite Cause I like your attitude Let's forget about our curfew Cause all that is stuck in my head Is me and you Both speed in my heart is pacing But I'm not sure I wanna pace it Cause it only does this with you Our bodies meet, I can feel the tension Move us into the next dimension Let's just let our bodies be true Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I will be bringing you guys a cook and clean with me. I know it's been a while since I cooked, so I'm bringing you guys some cooking today. But before I get too far into today's video, it's in collab with L'Oreal. So I'm just gonna go ahead and let her introduce herself here. Hi guys, my name is L'Oreal and I come from the channel Clouded by L. I am a stay at home working mom of three. I have two little boys and a little girl. I post motherhood. You'll also find really affordable mommy hacks and a ton of pantry organization and decluttering and of closets and sinks and things like that. I also cook dinner on Sundays just to give you a few recipes for your family. And every now and then I do a really big grocery haul and I really stock up so I'm not going out a million times with three toddlers and I decorate for holidays. Pretty much all things mommy plus homemaking so if that is your type of videos i post every tuesday thursday and sunday so i would love if you can come over here when you're done with this beautiful mama's video and check my channel out as well and hopefully decide to subscribe and hit that bell and i'll see you over there i have someone that wants to say something to you really quick though one second come to my mama channel and subscribe so once you are done with my video, head on over to L'Oreal's channel and check out her video and let her know that I sent you and tell her that I said hello. Now let's go ahead and jump into the video. So I'm just getting started in the bedroom and thank the Lord I didn't have too much going on this day. I just had to tidy up really quickly get our beds made and then I also had a load of laundry that I left in the dryer that needed to be folded so I'm just going to go ahead and fold that before I head into the bathroom and I won't be doing too much talking in today's video because I do have an excruciating headache while doing this voiceover so I won't be doing too much unnecessary talking but if you are new here then hello and welcome my name is Shalia and over here on my channel you will find tons of cleaning motivation just like this video and so much more so if that's the kind of content that you are interested in then go ahead and hit that red subscribe button and if you are coming over from l'oreal's channel then hello and welcome to you thank you so much for stopping by for today's video and i hope that you love my energy and my content just enough to go ahead and click that red subscribe button before you go
around your finger Tell me what you wanna do I think we're part of something bigger And now my mind is filled with you Oh, you know, oh, you know, oh, you know Oh, you know, oh, you know, oh, you know Baby, with a
So this is just a little hack if you also use a toilet bowl brush I always like to wash it out after every use and then I just pour in some Lysol or any type of disinfectant it doesn't have to be Lysol it could be bleach or anything that you use and I like to just add a little bit of water into the bowl and then just let that sit so this way it keeps the bathroom fresh and it doesn't have like a foul odor or anything like that because I'm still having a hard time finding my toilet wand refills out here. So that's why I've been using my toilet bowl scrub brush. But that is a little hack for you guys, like I said, to keep your bathroom smelling fresh. So I just wanted to go ahead and give the bathroom floor a really good thorough cleaning and a good disinfectant. Sometimes the mop is more convenient, but it's okay every once in a while to get on your hands and knees and just really get your bathroom floor nice and disinfected.
It's what you do So now we are getting into the cooking and yes, you guys have seen me make spaghetti so many times before, but since I've changed my eating habits, I'm making a healthier version. So instead of using the regular spaghetti, I will be using green lentil spaghetti, which is really, really good. I always use ground turkey, but then I'm going to use some turkey kielbasa sausage as well so i'm just going ahead and getting my water ball for the noodles and then i'm going to go ahead and chop up my onions for my meat watch the clock ticking off the wall but tonight i'm letting it go spend my coin for show i'm gonna be myself or i could be someone So if you guys have never tried putting sausages in your meat sauce, oh my gosh, you have to try it. I personally prefer the kielbasa sausage. That's what I'm using here. You can use the pork one if you eat pork or you can opt out and do the turkey sausage, which is what I'm using. It's really, really good. But y'all, this tastes so good. So like I said, if you've never tried doing it, you definitely have to give it a try. So now I'm going to add in my turkey meat with my onions and just season that up. As I've mentioned before, ground turkey is literally the best. I know people don't like it, but you have to really know how to season ground turkey. So I know it may look like a lot of seasoning, but trust me, this meat is seasoned to perfection. stars i want to drive a faster car i'm gonna be myself i'm gonna be someone else i'm gonna be myself i'm gonna be someone else i'm gonna skip my breaks so i just went ahead and drained my meat i don't like a lot of oil in my meat because then once i add my sauce it is just way too soupy so i like to put it in my colander and just let that drain so while that's draining i'm just going to get my sausages into the same pot and i just sprinkled a little bit of holy smokes seasoning over that so i'm just going to let that cook down a bit and then add my ground turkey to that and start adding my sauce Beautiful stars, I wanna take a trip to Mars. Nothing can break me, no, nothing can break me. But before I add my sauce, I totally forgot that at the very last minute, I decided to go ahead and add another recipe to this video. So y'all, this is so simple. This is literally a one pan meal. So all you have to do is just cut up some onions, dice up some red potatoes. You can use the regular white potatoes if you want, but I feel like for this meal, the red potatoes are perfect. 
So I just went on ahead and I just chopped those up and then I'm going to add the rest of the turkey kielbasa sausage to that because as you can see I didn't use the whole thing for the spaghetti. So I figured why not go ahead and just get two meals out of that and then I'm just going to sprinkle on my seasonings which I will show you. And you're going to drizzle some olive oil over that and toss it together with the tongs and pop this baby in the oven and you guys got a delicious meal when I tell you it is so good y'all have to try this I also wanted to pop in to mention that if you guys are interested, especially to my new subscribers in any of my other cook and clean videos, I will have my cooking and cleaning playlist down in my description box below. So you can go and check out some other videos where I did some cleaning and I also cooked some yummy meals. So like I said, that playlist will be down in my description box below so you can head and check that out. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and pop that into the oven and then I'm going to add in my spaghetti sauce and y'all this is my favorite brand i love this one it is so good and as far as the potatoes with the onions and the sausages i just let that cook on 350 for about 20 to 25 minutes because honestly the red potatoes are really quick to cook so it didn't take long at all so now i'm just going to add a little bit of my butter to my noodles and some minced garlic i love doing this it just gives your spaghetti such a great flavor and that's it you guys so i hope that you enjoyed this cook and clean with me if you did then go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up leave me some comments down below and introduce yourself if you are new and go ahead and hit that red subscribe button and make sure that your notification bell is turned on so you are notified every single time that i upload a new video thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to head on over to l'oreal's channel and see what she did and what she made for dinner i can't wait to head over there myself so thank you guys so much for watching stay blessed and stay safe and i will see you all in my next one bye guys